What's up, YouTube fans? I'm back at it again. Showing you how to make a core. If the first one didn't turn out right, you can check out this one. Get a better get a better understanding of how it's done. What I'm using here is um, epoxy. I'm going around the core with epoxy. I'm using a Pepsi can. And I use the glass. I put some um, a little a couple of strip strips of, of can around it to get the right distance in the little tape to get the right distance of of the magnet sort of go inside it sort of actually fit in there. I'm wrapping this around it. Get it around it because you can get it around it. It's real sticky. Turn it to get it on your hand. Y'all might have checked out my first first one about making cores with Loctite, and now I'm showing you how to make it with epoxy. And the best epoxy I'm using is the five minute epoxy right here, which works pretty good. What I'm gonna do is take the wire, it's on the spool, it's on the spool over there. The wire over there on the spool. the wire on. Take a piece of masculine tape. Get your distance where you want it. Well, I got mine marked already, so I know where I want it. Put the masculine tape down over it. And the cord to the wire to the side. Get it ready. It's wrap. It's gonna be a dual two. Make sure I'm going the right way with the drill. As you can see, YouTube fans, this is how it is. This is how it go. You go around, get the distance, about right. That's about right. Yeah, it's about right. If it's not right, you can always adjust it. I'm gonna go kind of slow at first, holding the wire, and you can go faster and faster as you want. But I guess you have to drill press just a little bit. So you have to see how it's done. You speed up just a little bit. If you get off a little bit, come back and just hit the button going around. What I use is like a drill, just make you some kind of jimmy rig jig. And I'm using a candle holder right there. Using a candle holder. You can see kind of good I'm using it. Candle holder right here. I've said that a couple of times, but you know, I knew all this. And the only different than epoxy and Loctite, epoxy allows you to allows you to sticky this. With Loctite, it's just like a, a, a it's like wet. It don't you gotta heat it. Well, you gotta heat it and keep it in place. But Loctite works really, really good, and I'll show you what I'm to do when you finish with this one. When I'm finished with this one, I'll show you how it actually goes. And bear with me, y'all. I'm kind of sleepy. I just woke up not too long ago. I'm trying to finish this one sub. I'm making. I'm building. I'm trying to finish this one sub. I'm building. Uh, trying to. 
position this phone a little better for you guys out there in TV land. Let's see if that's any better. Yeah, that's better. So I got a step off right here. Get all that taken over right there. I'm basically trying to show you guys how to how to build a speaker and you can get it back. Okay, now I'm about ready to wrap, finish wrapping it. Oh, I don't like that right there. Make sure it's tight. off because I'm looking at the camera. This stuff still sticky. But go and finish for it dry. And that's the end right there. A little cool. Right there. Now I'm going to run the pads back up to the top. And that's going to be voice core one. What I'm going to do is get some more epoxy. Put a little more epoxy on there. it up. Mix it up real good, like so.